All right, what's up guys? So, uh, just got a lead on a uh, motor and transfer free, like a 283, something like that, small block. Can't remember what he said it was. And uh, transmission, says they run good. I don't care if they run good or not, they're free. So let's go load up the trailer and get it. Is that a 283 turbo 350? He gave me all this other stuff for free too. Disc brakes with the spindles, the brake calipers there. Real cool guy. I got some other stuff I'll show you guys about him too. But pretty cool stuff. I'm pretty happy with it. Now I gotta decide do I want to use old school cool or do I want to keep using fuel injected and overdrive? You guys drop a comment down below on what you think I should do. You guys will have to excuse the wind. Got a couple of battery cables hooked up here, backwards, of course, red for negative black positive hooked into the starter we're gonna turn over a few times without any power to the uh coil just so that we can make sure that we have the uh the oil pressures even though i don't have anything hooked up for oil pressure so it's gonna make a mess if it does run but yeah we're just gonna turn over a few times you guys stick around for that Got oil pressure. She's popping out the back here. Trying to give me something to plug that with. that's good enough she's a runner we can throw her in all right guys once again forgive the wind but uh she's a runner so now what i'm gonna do is i'm gonna get all those parts off of the trailer and then i'm gonna pull the chassis underneath the gantry pull that v6 out put it on the trailer and then i'll pull the chassis back in and we'll put this guy on with that transmission bolted up so we're gonna do all that next it's gonna be a lot of fun here we go There you have it. I'm out of breath, but she's in there. 289, three, six, I don't remember. Turbo 350. Bad thing is, a few lines are on the wrong side now. A few pumps over there, but that's okay. We'll just take them, put them over there, be done. These manifolds didn't fit either, but that's okay. I'll put me a pair of shorties on there. I got some that go right through there. Should be perfect. Still got plenty of room for my radiator. I think it's supposed to go here, but I'm probably gonna put it down on these. If it fits, I don't know. Seems like it'd be fine right there though, but but make me a little shroud. Be good to go. I think if I moved it forward to the first hole, it might be better, but we'll see what happens. Anyway. That's it for today. By golly, I'm hot and sweaty. I've been working on this thing all day. The last three videos you saw were today. So I think I've earned it. Hit that subscribe button down there, over here, up there, wherever it's at, and uh, like the video. Try to get 2,000 subscribers with this build. Uh, if you could help me get there, that'd be great. Thanks for watching.